You know, beating an addiction is very hard work. Yeah, in fact, it's so complex, and that's why so many people end up failing. Well, in tonight's Connecting with Community, our Emma Returnin has the story of a mother who is definitely now, thankfully, beating the odds. Well, she grew up in rural Indiana. She lost her father. She lost a child. She was involved in a horrific car crash. You add it up, and she broke. She even turned to meth, and then she spiraled out of control. But tonight, I'm happy to report that Chelsea Terry is back. Would you like chips and a drink with that? No, just okay. the sandwich. Holding a job, earning a paycheck, keeping a schedule. The routines of a normal life that so long were out of reach for Chelsea Terry. You wouldn't have recognized her when she came in the doors here. The 32-year-old came to Wheeler Missions Women Recovery Center addicted to meth, frightened, and denied custody of her children. The person, when I was on them, I was very dark, very mean, very angry, very, you know, I was very depressed. She says she detoxed for an agonizing week. I did survive, and that, that is what's amazing, you know, and I did what everybody thought I would not be able to do, and I can only give the glory to God for that. Then Chelsea says she got to work, enrolling in the eight-month, 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. intensive recovery program called Higher Ground. If we don't solve the root cause of the problem, then we're not going to be able to really um, solve the real problem. The rigorous schedule includes counseling, working on coping skills. Probably not. And job training. Change can happen for sure. We see it every single day here. The women celebrate success they learn to express gratitude. A big shout out to um, my children and, you know, just enjoying life today as a sober parent. Yeah. Chelsea recently regained custody of all of her children. They now live with her and are thriving. It's been amazing even to see the change in the children since she's been here. It, it's hard. <laughs> it, there's nothing easy about it. There, it. There's not, you know, but God blessed me with four beautiful children, and that's what I needed to fight for. And now here I am with my children. I have custody of my children, and we are happier than what we've ever been in our lives. I love you. Oh. She certainly has come a long way. Now, she used to work in a dental office, and that really is her career passion. You should see her light up if she thinks she can help someone with a dental issue. So we're going to circle back, and maybe she can work her way back to the dental field someday. Back to you.